What's up, everybody? This is DJ Big Eye um, coming at you with a, a DJ tip on how to organize your MP3s because a lot of times you're at your gig and if you're a digital DJ and you're using your laptop with MP3s, a lot of times you're looking for a song and if you don't have them tagged right, you can't find them, especially if you have a large library. Uh, you know, mine, to me, I consider it large, but maybe to some DJs that have been doing it for a long time, it's a small library, but I got a good 550 gigs of music, and here recently I just started DJing, so now I'm finally starting going through the painful process of organizing these, because when I'm running virtual DJ, I'm trying to find these MP3s, and they're not tagged correctly, so it's not coming up in virtual DJ, and I know I have that song, you know, that's one of the worst feelings when you're at a gig, and somebody tells you, hey, can you throw this on and you're like uh yeah i got it and you type it in and virtual dj and boom you get nothing next thing you know you're hunting and searching it for it for it when you rather just be focusing on playing music and and mixing it and doing what you need to do so um i'm going to show you three programs that i use okay there's tag and rename it uh media media monkey gold then there's a uh, Another one, Fix Tunes. I just downloaded the trial software for that, but um, you have to purchase it. You can purchase it with PayPal. So I'm going to uh, pause this and show you on my laptop how I organize my MP3s and retake them. Okay, I'm going to start off with Media Monkey Gold. Um, what's cool is it has like Explorer right here on the left side. And the cool part of this zoom out, is it's a player and you can play your music listen to it real easy you can sync your iPod with it or any other mp3 player real easy um, but I like it to edit the files it has some good tools here in the files files to edit you can uh, go and filter your your library by you know unknown artists, unknown title, unknown genre, even duplicates, uh, unleveled tracks, dead links, album art. So like right now I'm an unknown al album. So like I said, I just started. I got a lot of work to do. But uh, let me see here if I can find one real quick. That's a uh, that's pretty well known because it has a little tool in here that works pretty pretty good. Let's see here. Uh, I'm getting picky now. All right, there's a Pearl Pearl Jam right there. Even Flow. Okay, what well, has a cool tool is that you can right click and you can go auto tag from the web, and it's gonna go into the web and it's gonna look for it's gonna look for the song. It's gonna search it out. So it's searching right now should find this one it's pretty popular boom there we go found it found the song so guess what you know there has the information year track all that good stuff so you can auto tag it you just hit auto tag downloads the album art and everything and you close this and there it is and it's all filled out now so real quick got me the info that I needed and if you were to click out of uh, unknown albums and click back in this would not be on the list anymore so that's that's pretty much the gist of this tool uh, for this I mean it does a lot of different things you can list podcasts listen to podcasts you can listen to the radio uh, internet radio all kinds of stuff it's a good little uh, media player for your Windows. Um, I'm not sure if it's on a Mac, but I'm pretty sure they probably make it. But um, it's a pretty cool tool if you have uh, a song that you want to find the tag for through the internet. So it's a good little tool. But you know, some of these ones that are like uh, unknown uh, artists or real, you know. Uh, DJ remixes it's gonna have a hard time finding those type of tags or albums so um, you might have to do those manually but 
that's uh, Media Monkey, and that's what I use it to to uh, edit my tags and get the info in there. Okay, and if you if you have a one artist and it's the same album, you can get all the info real quick, you know, and through the uh, tag through the web and get the album art and everything for it. So there's that one, and I'll show you tag and rename next.